Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, yellow shaded uh, right triangle uh, ADE fully confined uh, in a square uh, ABCD as you can see in this given diagram such that the area of this uh, yellow shaded triangle is uh, 6 centimeter square and the angle uh, DEA is uh, 60 degrees and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, blue square ABCD. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, blue square ABCD. I'm going to label uh, its uh, side length uh, as uh, lowercase a. Then all these uh, sides uh, of the square are going to be lowercase a as well across the board. And now let's recall the area of a square formula. Area is always equal to s square where uh, s represents the side length of the square. And in our case, uh, the side length of this blue square is lowercase a. So therefore, uh, the blue square area is going to become uh, lowercase a square. So now our task is to find the value of uh, lowercase a square. And now we are going to focus on this uh, yellow shaded triangle uh, ADE. And now let's recall this uh, trigonometric ratio. Tangent of theta is always equal to opposite side uh, divided by the adjacent side of the triangle. So therefore for this angle uh, 60 degrees uh, our opposite uh, side is uh, going to be this side and this uh, DE is going to be our uh, adjacent uh, side. So therefore we can write uh, tangent of uh, 60 degrees is going to be our uh, opposite side uh, is uh, lowercase uh, a divided by our uh, this adjacent uh, segment uh, is uh, d e length and now we know that uh, tangent of 60 degrees is uh, square root of 3 so i'm going to replace uh, that left hand side tangent of 60 degrees uh, with the square root of 3 over here so therefore uh, the left hand side is going to be square root of 3 is going to be equal to lowercase a divided by d e length and now i'm going to tweak the left hand side square root of 3 could be written as square root of 3 divided by 1 it doesn't make any difference whatsoever and now i'm going to flip uh, both sides uh, over so the reciprocal of this one is going to be d e length uh, divided by lowercase a is going to be equal to the reciprocal of this one is going to be 1 divided by square root of 3 and now i'm going to multiply both sides uh, with lowercase uh, a and here we can see lowercase a and lowercase a is gone so therefore uh, our uh, d e segment length uh, turns out to be a divided by square root of 3. So therefore our this uh, segment uh, d e length turns out to be lowercase a divided by square root of 3. And now let's focus once again on this uh, yellow shaded uh, right triangle uh, a d e. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area is always equal to a half times uh, base times the height of the triangle. And in our case, uh, the base of this uh, yellow shaded triangle uh, is uh, a divided by square root of 3. And the height uh, of this uh, triangle uh, is uh, lowercase a. And furthermore, uh, the area of this uh, yellow shaded triangle has been given to us as uh, 6 uh, centimeter square. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So the area of this triangle is uh, 6 is going to be equal to a half uh, times uh, the base of this uh, triangle is uh, lowercase a divided by square root of 3 and then times the height is lowercase a. And now if we multiply a times a is going to give us uh, a square. So therefore uh, we can write 6 equal to a square divided by 2 times the square root of 3 and now i'm going to isolate a square so i'm going to multiply this uh, right hand side uh, 
2 times square root of 3 and likewise I'm going to multiply the left hand side uh, 2 times square root of 3 as well and here we can see 2 times square root of 3 and this 2 times square root of 3 they are gone so therefore uh, our a square value is going to be equal to if we multiply everything uh, on the left hand side that is going to give us uh, 12 times uh, square root of uh, 3 but then we know that uh, the blue square area is being represented by a square and our a square value is 12 times square root of 3 so therefore we conclude that our uh, blue square area turns out to be 12 times uh, square root of uh, 3 centimeter square so thus after all the calculations and manipulations the area of this uh, blue square turns out to be 12 uh, times the square root of 3 centimeter square and in other words it's going to be approximately equal to 20.8 uh, centimeter square as well so therefore the area of this uh, blue square ABCD turns out to be 12 times the square root of uh, 3 centimeter square and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye